Meanwhile, Indonesia is all set to hold the 17th G20 summit in Bali this year, and reports suggest that the Russian President Vladimir Putin and also his Chinese counterpart Xi Jinping will be in attendance at the G20 summit. The meeting can initiate talks between the two leaders and the American President Joe Biden, who will also be present. The United States at this point is at odds with both Russia and China, owing to the Ukrainian conflict and the tensions that are simmering in the Taiwan Strait. Initially, it was unclear whether the two leaders will attend the summit or not. Now, Xi Jinping hasn't traveled abroad since the beginning of the pandemic, and Russia has been isolated after its invasion of Ukraine. However, in an interview with Bloomberg, the Indonesian president, Joko Widodo, has said that both leaders will be attending the G20 summit in person. Now remember, in the month of June, the Russian officials had informed that President Putin had accepted Widodo's invitation to the summit. They also added that he will attend as if the pandemic does not worsen the situation across the world. Meanwhile, China's foreign ministry has not commented on Xi Jinping's travel plans. The President Biden and the British Prime Ministerial candidate Rishi Sunak had called upon the G20 Council to bar Russia from the summit. However, Indonesia has maintained a neutral position and has called for a peaceful resolution to the months-long invasion by Russia of Ukraine. The President Joko Widodo vis visited both Kiev and Moscow earlier this year and tensions are also soaring between the US and China. Now, China has cut off talks with the United States on defense and also a range of other areas after the House Speaker Nancy Pelosi's visit to Taiwan. The White House has also criticized China's military drills around the island. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.